Thank you, Rance. Today, I am so honored to welcome the co-founders of Operation 22, whose mission is to raise awareness and put a stop to the heart-wrenching statistic that is 22 veterans a day, on average, take their own lives. So I want to welcome you both. First of all, you know, River City Live is, is a fun and exciting environment, but local challenges and local opportunities to help and love those around us are always really important to us. So thank you guys for sharing your time with us today. Yeah. Thank you for having us. Absolutely. So James, I want to kick it off with you. Can you give us a bird's eye view of the organization and, and how you got to where you are today? Yeah, absolutely. So Operation 22 was founded by three of us. We're all veterans, Army, Air Force, Navy. Um, we, we, found this statistic, 22 veterans a day are committing suicide, and that just was appalling to us, and we really want to make a stance against that. We want to raise the awareness, and we want to make people very much aware that we can put an end to this by getting the right resources out to these veterans. And what do those, what do those resources look like? Because we hear the statistic, and it's, and it's sad, and, and we hear that, but what are those resources that could change this? Mm -hmm. So by raising awareness, first off, and making people aware of the situation, uh, the second thing is, is making sure that they're, they're able to get the resources, whether it's through the VA, whether it's through private third-party entities, um, and then building a, a community and culture around uh, this veteran like we had in the military, the camaraderie, uh, and bringing it together and creating like a cohesive family. I love the fact that the three different branches all came together. Usually you guys are battling it out on the football field, but this is yep. a really yeah. special opportunity to work together. Now, you guys have some really poignant missions that are happening right now that are proving very, very effective, but you need our support. So talk to me about how we can rally around you and help you do what you do. Uh, we set a goal for us to raise um, uh, money so that we can provide our veterans with the resources. Our goal is that we can get 10,000 people to uh, do a monthly donation of $22 a month, and you can do that by visiting um, operation22.com um, and, and jump on there. But we've partnered with a couple of um, places like the VA, and we've partnered with uh, Halifax Health to help us with some of those resources that can um, get our veterans where they need for therapy. Um, but what, we, what we're going to do is we're going to take our veterans out to do something fun once a month, uh, recreate the camaraderie that we lost when we were in, uh, maybe deep sea fishing or a golf tournament or something like that. Something where we've got you stuck for some time where we can build a relationship with you and then make you tell your story. I mean, I kind of I kind of like that you hit the nail on the head there. You just said sometimes you do just need to be stuck with, with some people to be able to trust them, to right. open up. But it's really the best kind of stuck you could ever be because it's a stuck of support and people who want to love you and want to care about you and will give you a safe place to tell your story. So, Chase, can you just give us that website one more time so that we can stay connected with you and contribute? Yeah, so if you head over to operation22.com, uh, you can get a hold of us. You can get a hold of the resources that we have provided on the website. You can make a donation. Um, we're looking to get 10,000 uh, donors to donate $22 a month. Uh, that's very symbolic of the 22 veterans a day that are committing suicide. Um, you can follow us on Facebook at operation22.com, Instagram, and all the other socials as well. Guys, thank you so much for coming on to share River City Live, support your locals, and support your service people.